With Subsurface Analyst, you can convert cross-sections to 3D points that are included in surface interpolations. In this demo, we will show how to transform cross-sections to 3D point features that are used in an interpolation process to create raster surfaces representing 3D hydrogeologic units. We start with a set of geosection features forming a fence diagram. The fence diagram was created using the cross-section wizard available as part of the Arc Hydro groundwater tools. You can see that in this example there are three hydrogeologic units, a peat layer on top, a sand layer, and a gravel layer at the bottom. In addition, you can see that there are borehole picks located in between the cross sections. We will use the Geosection to Points geoprocessing tool available in the Subsurface Analyst toolbox. The tool inputs are the section line features, the 3D geo section panels, and the target bore point feature class. We also specify a sampling distance to determine the density of the points along the cross sections. You have the option to append the new points to the target feature class or to overwrite the features. In this case, we select to append to the bore point feature class such that the new points sampled along the cross sections are added to the existing borehole points. After running the tool, you can see that a new set of points has been added to the scene. These points were created by sampling along the cross sections at the given sampling distance. Next, we will interpolate a set of rasters representing the top of each hydrogeologic unit. We use the field filter in the Arc Hydro groundwater toolbar to filter points of a specific horizon. We then can use any of the interpolation tools available in ArcGIS to create a raster surface. In this example, we use the IDW interpolation. We repeat this process for all the horizons in our model. At the end of this process, we have a set of rasters representing top and bottom elevations of the different hydrogeologic units in our subsurface model. We can use these surfaces to generate new fence diagrams and volume models using subsurface analyst tools.